What's up guys, it's AJ and Skeleton Lord. Uh, this is the, the American version of Dead Rising. Because I was kind of missing some of the violence. Um, it's weird playing the Japanese and the American. Figured I'd uh, uh, kill some stuff for a few minutes. Ow! Freaking parasites. I love that animation he plays when you... Just wanted to screw around for a little bit, I guess. I'm gonna be doing a Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic if I can tonight. Got a lot of games to be playing, you know. guys that know that food in this game is spoiled, like, see? Uh, if you keep food in your inventory for too long, it'll either spoil or melt, and causing this. I I'm only doing it for the uh, gourmet achievement. Which I should get not too pretty soon. Thawed vegetables instead of frozen. That also works with ice pops. You can find in the game they will melt.
Perfect. There's a way you can jump off the glass, too. Like that. But I got a really bad controller. I'm not gonna get I only have to eat like one more food item before I get the gourmet achievement, but I'm not gonna do that right now. Because I'm not playing the way I should be, because I wanna get like an ending A with this while I do it so I can go for like an achievement run thing. I truly believe you have felt awesome unless you have used a 360 controller with the chainsaws and run into a crowd in this game with uh, the vibration on the controller. It doesn't feel the same with the Xbox One controller. I know that.
I love how they look a little bit human too, like they have like a humanish look to them. Just something I didn't see in Dead Rising 3 at all. And in 4, they were just like. Stop moving your head. Like, no, he, they didn't even look. They didn't even wear like actual clothes in 4. Like, who wears yellow and red pants? that are skinny in freezing cold. I don't get that. Like, I think the zombies would be wearing stuff like this in Colorado and Dead Rising 4, but no. Can you get that door for me, please? Can, can you? I don't think that's gonna do it. Uh, can one of you come here for a second? You, you look good. No. Okay, we're not doing the right skill move. Uh, there we go. Can you get that window? Can you? Oh, thank you, sir. You're so kind. Thank you. <laughs> I'd love to remaster this game. Know some Japanese customs and eat a Japanese radish really quick. I always love the guys in the beanies. people didn't notice this like a lot of people who recently played the game but when you go near a zombie that has the bee they will vomit blood at you go too close to him hey then you can take the bee Kill other zombies with it. Does anyone remember what they used to like print all through this game? It was just like anything and everything as a weapon. I love that phrase. Sometimes people forget about it though, it's just like... 
The new the, the newer games focus more on combo weapons, but personally I just didn't I never fell in love with combo weapons. Just not something that I cared about. I don't know why. It's never something I fell in love with. I, I was kind of disappointed by the way the uh, zombies looked in 2 when I first got it. I wasn't complaining or anything. I was just like, it doesn't look as, like, polished as the first game if you compare them. Like, the characters were a little bit too shiny. The skin wasn't like this. The zombies had, like, weird cracks in their skin that made them look all... These ones, you could, like, see people in them when you looked at them, like this guy. Not him. I don't want to look at his face. Like this guy. Like, you could see people when you looked at their faces like this. Or like this. You know, it resembled more of a person that was alive at some point. That's why I like the fact that they looked like some of the characters you can spot in the game. That's one of the features I want to like feature in my game, you know, like the zombies look more human. Like some people have a harder time killing them, I guess. Well, unless you're a sicko, but I'm just kidding. They're zombies, but you know. I'd like you to actually be able to like feel for the characters. Like, I kind of, you know, you kind of feel for these guys when you look at them and feel like they were once people, they were eaten and everything gives you a feeling when you look at him. Fuck it! Oh man, I busted her head open with that can. It's a nice hit. Canned sauce. Canned sauce. <laughs> Canned sauce. Canned sauce. Canned sauce. She killed my canned sauce. <laughs> Condiments. Ketchup. Cooking oil. Yeah! Baking ingredients! Some salt and some cooking oil never hurt anybody. Da 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 da! What else we got in this store? Cookies! Snacks! Slip on the pet food, by the way. It's 
So if you want a pet zombie, just do this. Get him some pet food and slip. Look at that pet food on the floor. Ice pops, if you want to throw ice pops at the zombie, just do it. Sicko. This episode quickly became, let's throw food items at zombies. Stop trying to pick up that arm. No one wants that arm but you. Throw your melons at zombies day. Throw your melons! I'm gonna make a t-shirt that's just like throw your melons at zombies day and it just shows Frank, Frank throwing melons at zombies. It's gonna be my new thing. The way he was staring at me for a second. See if we can get him to do it again. Hey, stop! I know we killed him, but we have red cabbage. And a hand. You want a hand? Yes, you do. Melon, attack! Otis is gonna come in here and <laughs> when this is all over. Frank, you left me a mess to clean. Throwing your melons at those zombies wasn't good for anybody. Throw my squash at a zombie now. Wonder what happens if we throw yogurt at a zombie. Or milk. Let's try milk. Let's try a grapefruit. Let's try an orange. Ow! God, I get it, okay. Let's try a milk carton. Or gallon. Ju I mean, jug, milk jug. Let's try coffee creamer. That's a fast zombie. Let's throw some yogurt at him. She'll slow him down. Let's throw some cheese at him. Throw some meat at him, some raw meat. Oh, I threw the wrong thing. Sorry, buddy. This video should be called "Eight hey, uh, says uh, zombies look like people and it's kind of hard to kill them and then goes on a murderous rampage with food items.
<laughs> hey Tay, how'd you become famous? I threw food items at zombies in a game for like 20 minutes. That sounds great. I know, right? Throw a fish at zombies. I remember you. I also remember you. I don't know you, but here's one. This isn't food, but whatever. It'll make do. We haven't tried any frozen pizza. Eat your melon, son. Let's throw a zucchini at him and then we'll be finished with this. They can get in from like outside if we break the window. Maybe they can get in through the window. Hey! They're gonna try. Peace out, guys.